Hello guys, welcome back to my video session and today in this video session we are going to discuss about uh, fundamental niche, realized niche, uh, both the definitions and also one example and differences between fundamental niche and realized niche. Okay, and before starting with the actual topic, I would like to share few key points so that you can understand this concept better. And here the first keynote is that we know the word computation, right? Uh, what is computation then? A computation is an interaction within or between species where either organisms or maybe populations are competing for the same resource. Okay, just make it simplify. Competition means it's a competition between two uh, species for uh, same resource we can say. And in competition there are two types that is intraspecific competition and inter competition here intraspecific competition means intraspecific competition intra means within okay remember intra means within intra okay occurs between the members of the same species and about intraspecific species here occurs between different species Okay, that's about that. And in our previous video, we have uh, studied about ecolo of, uh, ecological niche, uh, aspects of ecological niche. Those are uh, uh, spatial niche, first one is spatial niche, second one is tropical niche and third one is n-dimensional or multi-dimensional niche which is also called as Hutchinson niche okay if for more details about uh, spatial or granules niche or tropical niche and Hutchinson niche I have discussed in, in the previous video you can go there and watch it okay to, there I have said about uh, this multi-dimensional or Hutchinson niche can be explained by fundamental niche and realized niche. So this is the time now we are going to learn about fundamental niche and realized niche. Okay. So let's start with the with the definitions of fundamental niche and uh, realized niche. Here let us know uh, the definition. Fundamental first one the fundamental niche and entire set of conditions through which an animal can live and reproduce. It's an entire set of conditions, okay? There, an animal can live and reproduce. Means, the key point here is that in the absence of competition. The definition for realized niche is here. A realized niche is a set of conditions mainly used by the animal after interacting with other species means in the presence of competition okay let us understand this with an example uh, we know that there are two species that is uh, uh, chatamalus species and balanus species these are nothing but Barrancus, which lives uh, uh, near the uh, rock shore environment in the seashore. Okay. Uh, this, uh, so we know that uh, each species is tolerant of a range of certain environmental conditions such as the temperature, light, moisture which are essential for their survival mechanisms and for growth, reproduction and feeding. Okay, so here uh, this Tetanamus species, it is a smaller size 
and which is going to live in both deep and shallow water and with which uh, this chatalamus species which stands exposure in air means that can survive in if it is exposed to air but in case of uh, balanus species they are larger species okay these are balanus species these are uh, uh, chatamala species and these uh, lives only in the deep water these can lives in uh, deep and shallow water both but here these can only live in the deep water and these are rarely exposed to air but these are they can withstand if it is they are exposed to air okay that's about the nature of these uh, chatamalas and uh, balanus uh, species uh, in a simple way we can say like this here chatamalas can survive dry conditions uh, better than balanus so it can live higher up on the rocks and uh, this chatapalas is more tolerant of physical stress when comparing to the balana species so here i draw the diagram i guess this is uh, good enough okay fine here um, think there is no competition here i am explaining about the fundamental niche fundamental niche it is about uh, without comp uh, competition in the absence of competition means only one kind of species is present here this can uh, live in the shallow and shallow and uh, deep water okay it can it can occupy upper zone also lower zone also in the absence of the competition okay that's about the fundamental niche means it can withstand any kind of uh, uh, physical stress it can occupy the any place okay but when these balanus species will arise what happens these balanus species will not tolerate the dehydration or they will never exposed to the air so they will live in the bottom of the sea shore so they will compete with this chatamalas species they will live only at the bottom so yes these can live in both uh, uh, bottom and top so they will these species will outcome these to the upper zone okay these will never occupy the bottom shore when these species are present that's about the realized niche okay this is in the absence of competitor this is in the presence of competition let us look, look go back to the definition here what it says so now we can understand better an entire set of condition through which an animal can live and reproduce that represents the fundamental niche realized niche is a set of conditions mainly used by the animal after interacting with the other species in the presence of competition that's about the fundamental niche and realized niche so in graphical representation we can represent like this this is species a and species b means this uh, space if it is absent this whole uh, space is uh, occupied by species a if the species b will arise this will outcome this species a okay this is the graphical representation of the uh, two species which represents the fundamental niche and this is the fundamental niche and this is the realized niche okay then uh, this uh, fundamental and uh, um, realized niche they will uh, shows here this uh, because of due to inter specific competition inter specific competition i guess i have explained this at the beginning of this video inter specific competition means competition between the two different species okay this is the key point for the examination now let us go for the differences 
the fundamental niche is also called as pre competitive niche realized niche is also called as post competitive niche the second difference the niche of an organism in the absence of limiting factor in the environment those called as fundamental niche the fundamental niche of an organism or niche of an organism in the absence of limiting factors in the environment here the niche of an organism in presence of limiting factor in the environment that is called as realized niche next here it is the theoretical niche the fundamental niche is a theoretical niche and realized niche it is where the species actually lives and fundamental niche explains various roles of a particular species whereas realized niche explains what the species actually does and your fundamental niche is comparatively large in size and realized niche is comparatively smaller in size okay guys this is about the fundamental niche and realized niche if you are new to this channel please do subscribe to my channel thank you everyone